Hi, welcome to the most interesting part of Rocket Plus, the app crafted for pro traders. This is where the action is. This video is all about placing various types of orders. To begin, first select the security which you want to buy or sell. Let's take Swiss loan or Yes Bank for example. If you want, you can add the security in the watch list and directly buy or sell it. I am adding this security to the watch list so that I have access to many interesting tools for an informed trading experience. When you tap on any security from the watch list, a small menu slides below. The first option with a magnifying lens symbol is called code. Tap on it to see the market tip. From this page, you can navigate to charts, option chain, ladder and even complete your trade by choosing to buy or sell. You can access these tools from the slider menu also. Now tap on buy or sell box and it will take you to the order placing page. On the top, you can select the exchange in which you want to trade. Also, you can change to buy or sell by tapping the slider. Product Types CNC that is cash and carry is used for delivery based trading in equity. In delivery based trade, you intend to hold the stocks overnight for however long you wish. Using CNC product type, you will not get any leverage for most stocks nor will your position be auto squared off. You will not be able to take any short positions using CNC. However, you can sell the stock from your holdings using this product type. MIS that is Margin Intraday Square Off is used for trading intraday equity, intraday FNO and intraday commodity. MIS product type is used to get the intraday leverage. You can check the margin provided in intraday using MIS product type on our margin calculator. The link is given in the description below. All open positions under a MIS product type will automatically get square off if they are not closed before the auto square off time. The link for auto square off timings is given in the description below. NRML NRML is used for overnight trading of futures and options. You can use this NRML product type in equity, currency and commodity derivatives to carry out your position till expiry. Intraday leverages won't be provided using this product type. Cover order a cover order is an order with an inbuilt risk mitigation mechanism. Simply put, a cover order is a market order or limit order that is placed along with a stop loss order. Since a stop loss order is placed, the maximum loss you will bear is known in advance if the trade moves against you. Cover order's purpose is to reduce the risk of the trader. Since a cover order is either a market order or a limit order placed along with a compulsory stop loss order in a specified range, you cannot cancel this stop loss order. Considering the stop loss order is being placed at the same time while getting into the contract, the risk automatically reduces. Cover order is only for intraday and any open intraday positions will be auto squared off by our system if you do not square them off within the stipulated timings. To place it, select CO, then select the quantity and set the trigger price. There is a trigger price range to indicate that you set within the range. So when the price hits the trigger price, your order will be squared off. Swipe to place the order, click on confirm order, your order will be placed successfully. Order types, limit order, market order, stop loss limit order and stop loss market order. Now we are going to see about limit market, stop loss limit and stop loss market orders. Limit order A limit order allows you to buy or sell a stock at a price that you have set or a better price. The advantage of placing a limit order is that you can place buy or sell order at the desired price. However, there is a chance that your order may not get fulfilled partially or completely depending upon if a counter order is available for some quantity or none at the price you have specified. To place it, click on limit and enter the quantity. Swipe to place the order and click on confirm order. Your order will be placed successfully. Market orders. A market order allows you to buy or sell a stock at the best price available. If you are placing a buy market order, you want to buy a specified quantity of stock from the exchange at any price available. Similarly, if you are placing a sell market order, you want to sell your quantity at any price buyers are willing to give. Select market. Enter the quantity and swipe place order, click on confirm order, your order will be placed successfully. Stop loss orders A stop loss order is a buy or sell order placed to limit the losses when you fear that the price may move against your trade. There are two types of stop loss orders. Stop loss limit order that is price plus trigger price. Stop loss market order that is only trigger price. 
case 1 if you have a buy position then you will keep a sell stop loss case 2 if you have a sell position then you will keep a buy stop loss stop loss limit as the name states there is a limit on the price at which they will execute there are two prices specified in the stop loss order the trigger price which if triggered will convert the order to a normal limit order at the exchange to place it click on stop loss limit enter the quantity then limit price and set your trigger price for buy stop loss limit price should be greater than trigger price and for sell stop loss the stop loss limit price should be lesser than trigger price then swipe to place the order click on confirm order your order will be placed successfully stop loss market as the name suggests here you can set only the trigger price which if triggered will convert the order to a market order at the exchange to place it click on stop loss market enter the quantity and the trigger price for buy order trigger price should be greater than last traded price and for sell order trigger price should be lesser than last traded price then swipe to place the order click on confirm order your order will be placed successfully now let's see the other keys available in the order placing tab validity in this two type of function are available day and ioc a day order is valid till the trading day ends if not executed by the end of the market hours it is immediately cancelled ioc order means immediate or cancelled order and is either fulfilled right away or cancelled later amo after market order an amo is a sort of order that an investor places after the market session has ended at the start of the next market session this order is put on the exchange for the nsc nfo and currency segments the best time to place an amo is between 5 pm to 9 am